Hi, I'm Valerie Dawson. And I'm Chuck Troutman. And we are founders of Dawson Method Golf. And we're out here today at the beautiful Starfire Country Club in Scottsdale. And uh, Val, I have a lot of people ask me if the Dawson Method Golf will help them overcome the mental lapses they have on the golf course. Absolutely. The answer is yes. Dawson Method Golf will help you with those mental lapses. In fact, we specialize in that. We teach you a special mental technique so that you can overcome those mental lapses and get back in the zone. But we wanted to share with you a couple of tips today on what you can do right now to start working on those mental lapses. Now the first thing is that you want to focus on what you want to do. You want to focus on your goal. It's just like anything else. If you focus on your problems, you're going to have more problems. If you focus on what you want, then you're going to create more of what you want. So you've had trouble with that before, right, Chuck, on the golf course? Well, you know, you got water on the right and out of bounds on the left, and you're thinking, oh my God, you know, I've, I've got to avoid that water. I can't hit it out of bounds. And, uh, not the wrong way, right? That's right. So what you need to do is focus exactly where you want that shot to go and there's a much better chance that you will hit that shot. Now the other technique that I want to show you is something that probably you do already, but maybe not enough of, and that is to take in a nice, deep, relaxing breath. That will help to center you. If you feel like you're off your game, if you're not quite in the zone, what you can do is just take in a nice, deep breath and then exhale really slowly. And tell yourself something like calm, or relax and that will help you to center yourself and get back in the zone so you have a better chance of making that shot. You know and the other thing we all do is we get that macho thing and we try to hit the impossible shot. We've hit it in the trees and we have a small space to hit the ball through to move it toward the green so we try to do that and rattle it off three trees and, and we turn a five into a seven and what you really have to do is take your medicine punch it out in the fairway and, uh, and just give up the one shot and the same thing is shooting at impossible pins you know it's better to be in the center of the green and take two putts than to hit it in the bunker or into the hazard because you went for an impossible pin. So I think those are probably three good tips for you to avoid mental lapses. And if you want to read my story on how I cut my handicap from 15.6 to 8.8 .8 in just six weeks with the Dawson Method Golf, then read the story.